So we have a, a joystick that goes up, down, right, left, and we also have an enter button and a cancel button. We're gonna go down with the joystick to the commissioning menu. The arrow to the left-hand side of the screen is pointing towards commissioning, and I'm gonna press enter. My first option is quick start. I'm gonna to wanna to go through this menu every time I'm starting up a new unit. The first option there says cooling, hashtag CLG STGS for number of cooling stages. I'm gonna get into that. I use the enter button to get into the menu or into the sub menu. And it's telling me that I have two cooling stages set. If I want to change it, I'm gonna press enter. It's gonna to start to flash and then I'll use the joystick to go down or up to adjust the number of cooling stages that I have. For my purposes right now, I'm gonna keep it at two. And I'll press the enter button again to save. It'll ask me to confirm, I'll press enter again. It's confirmed. I press cancel. Over here, same thing, heating stages. I'm set to two. I cancel to get out of the menu. It takes me back a step. And then I keep scrolling down. I got heat pump stages. That's just set to zero. Refrigeration systems. How many refrigeration stages do I have? I have one stage, two stage, three stage. How many, how many different circuits do I have? For my purposes right here, I'm set to two. My fan control type, fan CTL type. I'm set to fixed variable which basically means I have a constant volume application with a VFD. If I had constant volume with single speed, I don't have a VFD in my unit, then I'd want to press enter, and I would want to change that to single speed. Now it's displaying single speed and it's flashing. The third option would be just variable speed, and that would be for VAV applications. I'm gonna keep mine on fixed variable, press enter, and it saves. Press cancel to go back. T-stat only is only yes or no. If I am using a thermostat, then I'm gonna to wanna to keep it set to yes. If I'm not using a thermostat and I'm controlling my unit off of any other, you know, external input, BAS, return air temperature sensor, wall temperature sensor, then I'd have to set that over to no. Fan on OCC. Do I want my fan to be on whenever I'm in occupied mode? A lot of people will want to change this option to no. It usually comes from the factory set to yes. So if you have the fan running all the time, you might just have to change this parameter from yes to no. Press cancel to go back. My here I can see my economizer minimum position. Again, this minimum position is only for heating and cooling purposes, not when running fan only. That's a different minimum position set point that you set in the economizer menu. I can see my SAT. I can see my return air temp, RAT, OAT. My cooling status, my heating status. Is my cooling enabled? I can change it from here. I can change my heating enabled as well by pressing enter and switching it to no. If I have a defective gas valve or something and I just wanna make sure to take the extra step and keep the heating disabled, okay? Um, now I wanna go through this menu every time I start up a new unit and make sure all these settings are set properly. Press cancel to go back, all the way back, start, come back to commission.